This is a video response to Secular Numinist's video of Destiny Ascension. In the video you say, uh, you give an example. <coughs> uh, I think you did it in your other video as well. Yeah, saying that if you buy goods with your equal money and you consume half of them and you create an abundance of goods and then you sell them to people around you for a slightly higher price um, where's the abuse in that because supposedly you're doing them a favor for saving them travel costs and making it easier for them in that aspect. In an equal money system, the everything will be provided. Everything that you need will be provided. So there will be no like travel costs the money that you will use to provide your means of transportation will be given to you. So there will be no having to work for it because transportation is a necessity. So really you would not be saving them any costs because they don't have to spend money for travel. Meaning that the money system won't work the same. They will not have to work their ass off to get money and then that money will be spent away. They will be given money. So really, it's not really saving them any money. Yeah. It's not saving them any money because in essence they don't actually have to gain it and spend it. It's given to them unconditionally to provide the means so that they can transport themselves to the distribution places. I quote or use that because it's not really said that there's distribution places of goods. And this whole point of how is that abuse, it is selling things for a slightly higher price for convenience is the abuse within the system. For example, a clothing company um, gets their clothing made in Indonesia for cheap prices so that they can sell it to the consumers in North America for cheap prices and they say that yeah we're doing them a good by giving them cheap prices to buy their clothes when in essence there is utter abuse through getting for paying Indonesians incredibly less for making a product and putting them in hard labored conditions so there is actual abuse and uh, that whole abuse is price manipulation and in an equal money system there will be no price manipulation because there will be no point to it and the equal money will be non-transferable meaning that if I pay you for a good that means you don't get my money it just simply gets deleted from my account. So you will not get money for you selling me anything. And that takes away this whole profit-driven, um, cheap, product-made system. Because gaining money will be taken out of the equation, so what's left is, what can I give to you that you actually need? Because I get nothing in return. It is an unconditional giving of goods 
in an equal money system as equal money system I'm sorry equal money is an unconditional giving as the means to uh, purchase the goods so that whole scenario I mean sure yeah you could uh, go to a distribution place and eat less or consume less of what you bought and sell it to uh, somebody who's closer but really you'll be gaining nothing you won't have money to gain from that so it, it, that kind of just takes your whole scenario and it's it becomes irrelevant and it is abuseful because it's money manipulation and you're taking more of their money than what is necessary and as well since uh, Transportation will be provided unconditionally. The, the the point of them, if it were even possible to buy from you at a slightly higher price, would be taken away because they don't have to spend money on fuel and transportation because it's unconditionally given. So to consider that consider that whole aspect within the equal money system because that seems like one thing that you are missing thank you